Okay, so um, I have the soup container thing, and I think the base layer substrate is going to be um, peat moss because I have a big bag of it. I think that'll work. I was thinking about naming it a slug curry because that's what was in this container before it and it still kind of smells like curry. So I think that's a very suiting name. Let's put a little bit more. Okay, so now that we have that, I'll put it in here just in case it tries to escape. Now that we have that, um, yeah, that's good enough. I'll add some water later, maybe. <sighs> Um, we have to, here, okay, so, I think the patches of moss, at least most of it, is out in the front of my yard, because this is basic, my backyard is basically dead grass everywhere, so my front yard actually has grass, but I'm afraid if I leave, that curry will escape. So, um, just, I don't really have any op other options if I want moss, and I do. So, I guess I'll have to make a run for it because, well, I just, I could just fast walk, I guess. But, uh, it's pretty, curry's pretty slow. But, whenever I was waiting for my mom to bring me a container, I, and I was sitting by curry, I almost lost him for a minute because... Um, he went on the other side of the rock that I found him on and that was in with like a span of like 30 seconds so oh I should have brought the shovel here I'll use this I guess I'll just dig it out with a stick well that came off pretty easy wow I just got a good pass patch um, I'm gonna cover the whole thing in it. And I'll just add a little bit more to this corner. I know I'm gonna get a lot of comments about, oh, disinfect your moss or whatever. Disinfect whatever you've got that side. And I know that's probably a better idea, but first of all, I don't really have time for this. Second of all, it was all curry was already outside so maybe it's like immune to the bacteria in this i don't know i just i don't i also don't know how to disinfect moss i could learn how but once again i'm on a, a little bit of time here so i think i should be good hopefully uh, this is moss i got hopefully curry doesn't escape while i was gone i was only gone for like well, like a minute Right there. Okay, that was good. The, I, I think I was overreacting like a lot, but I really want to keep this because it was a, it was actually pretty. I don't know much about slugs, but I don't normally find them during like winter time, so I think it was pretty surprising. At least it was surprising to me that I actually found something. I kind of thought I would have to scrap my last video, the one where I actually found curry. I thought I, had to, I was going to have to scrap that because it was like 10 minutes in and I didn't find anything. But then, oh, I got to put this rock back. But then curry showed up and saved the day. Um, I put a little bit of mud from, no, well, right there. In there. Um, put this rock back. There's also an isopod or roly-poly whatever you want to call it um it wasn't one of those cool ones that at least i see online like that one of the zebra orange striped fanta flavored ones it was just a gray one like a normal roly-poly thing let's check on this it's looking good um let's see what else can i add mm, yeah I guess I can kind of make it look like my other one by picking some weeds. This will help with my backyard grass growth and curry's habitat. Uh, depending on how good it looks, I'll pick more. 
Uh, sorry if I'm breathing loud. I guess it looks okay. I can get some more. Uh, you are a lucky winner. How are you doing? Oh, right there. Does that look okay? I think it looks okay. Maybe, um, probably not, but maybe they're just, because I'm picking the roots with it, so there might be a slim chance that it spreads, and curry will have multiple, like, things everywhere, and I'll have to miss this every so often, and maybe that will boost the chances. I know, uh, hang on, let's check on this before we go. I'm doing good. I know of these weeds, oh gosh, six minutes in. Anyways, I know of these weeds that have like seeds on the end of them, so when the wind is blowing, the seeds fall off and the weeds spread. I found a lot of those in my front yard and backyard in the summer or spring or fall, every season but winter. And it is currently winter. I gotta go quick, this video is getting long. Um, so, I don't think we'll be able to find one of those. Uh, maybe, probably not. Let me just sprinkle some of this. Oh God, that covered up the plants. That was a bad idea. Oh, I have a good idea. I don't know what slugs eat, but if they eat kind of similar to what snails do, then I should probably put some um, like bark from this wood in there because I did that for my snails and I kind of sort of didn't feed them for a little while but they, I put like a good piece, big piece of bark in there and they were just eating that so I didn't really have to feed them and I think it was due to like the low moisture that they sadly passed away um see like uh, uh, I don't know I gotta go kind of quick, mostly because, well, first of all, because this video is getting long. Second of all, because I want to get Curry into his new home as fast as possible, and that's not really working out as I. Pl oh, what are you getting off track again? But is that like a grub? Oh, it's just a grub. That's a that's sad. It looks kind of green in the lighting, but I think it's like yellowish white anyways get, i'm getting off track um i need to find a good piece of bark whenever oh didn't see that. but whenever i didn't have funyun's little overhang thing that she has now i just used like a big piece of bark but it, it kept breaking not surprisingly but it kept breaking so i got her that but i don't have another one of those for the slug I guess I can just use this. I wanted it kind of be like, to be like, like protect coverage, kind of. You know what I mean? Like this, I guess this works. It's kind of at like, kind of a half circle. Oh, I gotta. It's kind of in the shape of a half circle. So I guess that'll work. Oh, I underestimated how big this is. I'll have to break off a piece. Okay. Okay, that's good enough. I don't know what angle you just got, but hopefully it was a good one. Anyways. Uh, that doesn't look good, but I guess I can put it like that. I gotta make sure it doesn't like fall out. I want that isopod that I found on this, but it's probably long gone now, and this video is getting long, so. I'll look for it probably later. I'll put some dirt around. Oh, I said this video would be two minutes at the most. I lied to myself. Put some dirt around this so it doesn't um, fall, I guess is the word. Yeah, topple over, whatever. 
Maybe some leaf litter just in case I do find an isopod. Alright, that's good enough for me. Curry. I don't know how. How am I gonna get you in there? I guess if we take this stick, stick thing, break it. Alright, I'm just gonna stop the video here. I'll get Curry in there in a moment and maybe post a YouTube shorts about how he's enjoying, he or she, I don't really know, how it's enjoying its new life, but uh, I'll see you later. Bye.